So I just saw Mad Max Fury Road, and I thought it was awesome! The way they take all those commonplace objects and reimagine them? Who knew a garden tool could look so badass? And what is that? A CPAP mask? So I was inspired, and I thought I'd take some of that garbage from the front and turn it into something awesome, badass, and fun. Today on Fanboy to Farmer, we're making a tire swing. First, you need a tire. My daughter helped me choose one and trucked it up to the house. This kid totally gets it. You're gonna need three four-foot lengths of chain. Then you're gonna need three eye rings, six washers, six nuts, three quick closes, a carabiner, a drill with a bit the diameter of the eye rings, a rope, and of course a tire. And here's how easy it is. Drill some drainage holes in the bottom of the tire. Measure out three holes equal distance from each other. Drill your holes. And when you're using power tools, it's a good idea to have as many children around as possible. I'm kidding. These children don't listen. Where are the parents? Oh wait, I'm one of their parents. Next, thread a nut onto the eye ring, followed by a washer, drop it in the hole, and do the same thing on the bottom. Tighten the eye ring until it resists your power. Attach a quick close to the eye ring. Attach the end of the chain to the quick close. Do that two more times. Attach a carabiner to the end of all three chains. Boom, tire swing. Now, you gotta hang it. Find a tree branch that'll let the tire hang about, I don't know, foot and a half off the ground. Getting the rope over the tree is both fun and frustrating. Once you get the rope over the limb, pull down the end and tie some kind of knot. Uh, you know the saying, if you can't tie a knot, tie a lot. Attach the carabiner to the rope. Tell the children to get out of the way and let that thing fly. And you, my friends, have yourself a tire swing. Look at the joy. What a lovely day.